What's up guys, Jinx here with another PMP update. At the beginning of the year, we highlighted Dave as one of the five British rappers that you should look out for in 2017. But his growth over the past 12 months is so impressive that we're taking a deeper dive with another numbers on the board. If you follow the UK rap scene closely, you might have started to see Dave appear in freestyles in 2015, but Drake remixing Dave's song Wanna Know and debuting it on OVO Sound Radio in 2016 was a breakout moment. The track now has 36 million plays on Spotify, another 5 million on SoundCloud and YouTube. This is Drake's remix of Dave's Wanna Know. A month ago you didn't wanna know, but now I'm seeing though. These catties, they be calling off my phone, all these men and they blow me on the road. Free smoke. Anybody wanted, they could get it, no joke. Dave returned the favor, dropping a new version of Drake's Two Birds No Stones, but it's his overall talent rather than any big name co-sign that should make you respect this teenage artist. Here's Dave at legendary British studio Made of Veil playing piano and performing a stripped back version of Picture Me. Listen to my scripture, like teachers with teardrops, principles a killer, all for the skriller. But it's not hard, it comes from within, so don't let anybody tell you to put drugs in a cling. Picture Me is from the Six Pass EP, which dropped in September 2016. And on the project, Dave talks about the parts of London that doesn't appear in the tourist brochures. However dark things get, Dave remains hopeful, sharing a positive message to keep dreaming big, whatever your situation is. He's versatile too. It sounds ill over a heavy grind beat as well as a simpler piano. This is Thiago Silva with AJ Tracy. Man mystic with a pen like JK True say I ain't really a drinker But I got love for brandy like Ray J Champagne popper 44 chopper in a black night bomber Heartbeat stopper Half our MC dropper 45 whopper Leave you in the states like caca His blend of gritty rapping and smoother melodies Caught Drake's attention And although Day was already seeing solid growth The Drake remix of One and No in late October Gave him a major boost On Spotify, Dave's followers increased by 7,627% in the past year And the top track One and No has 36 million plays on YouTube, he gained 39.5 million plays in the past 12 months, an 8,545% increase. He's also gained 160,000 Instagram followers, which is a 970% increase in the last year, and added 52,000 Twitter followers. While 2016 was huge for Dave with his first headline shows, visits to America, and videos for four tracks from his EP, he's kept the momentum going in 2017 with regular new music, videos, and interviews. In January, he dropped Samantha with fellow rising star Jay Huss, which has 16.5 million YouTube plays and over 11 million Spotify streams. In March, Dave and AJ Tracy hit North America for a quick tour with sold out shows in New York, LA, and Toronto. I was at one of them. It was dope. He even stopped by High 97 for an interview which showed that as quick as he's blown up, Dave has remained humble and it's worth listening to on everything from the difference between grime and rap to race issues in the UK and America. We're all going to face discrimination wherever we go in whatever walks of life. It doesn't mean that we don't understand it because we're from a different like country or continent. Like I mean, I'm from the UK, there's still a lot of racism in the UK, but I'm not comparing my racism to your racism. It's not a competition. It's just that it happens. In April, we got a video game inspired track called Revenge, and most recently, Dave dropped new track 100 M's with a video that a surprise cameo from Sam Smith. Right now, life's just lovely. I wish you could have seen that girl's face when she jumped on Twitter to send, and she saw me on a track with I got 10 people that I love. Look, I don't want a hundred friends. Dave's putting up numbers on the board, and he's doing it while staying true to his roots. He hasn't released a bad track yet, and he's moving like a pro. It looks like Dave is the next to blow up out of the UK, and he deserves it. What you guys do in the last 12 months? If you're familiar with Dave, let us know what your favorite track is and jump in the comments with who you think should be next on one of these numbers on the board videos. Shout out to Indify for the information. I'm out.